first I'd like to show you the Revolto Beast, uh, which is a follow-up from our former uh, Revo NACL. Uh, there is uh, some specific changes to it. Uh, first of all, you will see that the profile of the wheel is, is a little different. It's lower than, than before, which actually gives you better grip when you put it on a rod. Uh, another thing that is changing is that it's, it's slightly longer on this angle, which means that it allows the spool to be not as wide. It, it is a bit deeper though, so we still have the same line capacity. And the really good thing about this is that the line guide when you have a more narrow spool, it doesn't have to travel that far, which makes, uh, 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 gives you better castability. Another change is, is the package you see here. It's quite large, and obviously it contains uh, uh, the gearing and also the brake washers, which in this particular case means that you have a, a, a more powerful product, both in, in retrieving and in drag. So the drag is, is uh, really state-of-the-art for this type of product. Another change we have made is, is the release button. It's very soft, still very stable, uh, which works uh, extremely well. So it's, it's a reel that is intended for very, very heavy fishing, uh, big pike, uh, musky in North America. Uh, will be uh, Another thing I want to mention is that in the box, we'll, mm -hmm. the box will include two additional handles. This one is for casting, it has a counterbalance. This one obviously is not for casting, that is for jigging. Mm -hmm. So the Revo Toro Beast will be a complete series. It will contain a, a size 50 and 60. It will 51 and 61, which means that they are left hand retrieve, which is this. And we also have two uh, different uh, gear ratios. So that's the Revo Toro Beast, won an award yesterday evening. <laughs> and it is possible to buy it in Poland? It will be, yes. It will be, yeah? Yes, not, not right now. Starting from 2016 or uh, this it, year? It will probably start to uh, end this year for this particular reel. Okay. <clears throat> Here's another reel for, for very heavy style of fishing. This is called the Ambassador Beast. Uh, one very specific thing about it is that it's being produced in, in uh, Svengsta, Sweden. So it's a Sweden-made reel. It is based out of the Ambassador uh, rocket. So the in, inside is, is a, a rocket version. Mm -hmm. uh, one thing that is really different with this compared to any other Ambassador is that you see we have a frame that is in one piece. So one piece aluminum frame which makes it extremely durable. Mm -hmm. I mean, there, there is not a classic bait cast reel that is as durable as this. I mean, the, the braking system is state of the art. We have a really cranking style of handle, mm -hmm. and uh, it looks quite nice. Yeah.